Alright guys, I'm just playing some Supreme Ruler 2020 Gold. I'm kinda disappointed because apparently FAP sucked up all my hard drive space so I ended up having to delete all my files. Well not all of my files, I just mean all the FAP, FAPS files that I had from my Canadian series but I decide, you know what, how about we go crazy, let's do a Russian series. Single player, campaign. You could always try Germany. I've tried Germany before, but I don't know if I really want to do that right away. Let's take a look at what we can choose for countries. I do really want to try Finland. Like, that's always been bugging me. Tried France before, and I've quite enjoyed it. Sorry, it just gets its ass handed to it because it goes a little bit nuts. I like to play as the UK, usually. Philippines. Hmm. How about we try Russia? Like I said earlier, may as well. Set it to medium. Uh, I'll just set this to easy. No, I'll keep it on normal actually. Economic difficulty, very, very easy. Normal, no debt. May as well, don't need to. Fixed capitals, we're turning that on. Hot relations. Keep that how it is. I don't know what this does, so I'll disable it. Sure. Abundant. No new bonds. Approval effects. Well, oops. Critical United Nations, no. Random events, low. Keep that the way it is, we'll, we'll launch a game. Welcome to Russia. The motherland. We should let at least one day pass before we take a look around. Sure. Oh no. Being Russia, I think we need more military goods. Da 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 da. Uh, yeah, we don't really need sh any shortage. Three million, three point five million versus two hundred sixteen thousand. I think we're actually kind of okay. But uh. We finally have the strength in our economy to truly support our status as a superpower on the world stage. And with the support of an allied China, there is no limit to our potential. Yeah. Fuck yeah, China. Actually, maybe we should actually ally ourselves to China before and say that. Uh, and stay nice and allied to China. I don't like North Korea, but I'm gonna all of myself to them because South Korea will be a pain in the ass just to deal with later on. I don't quite want to deal with South Korea just quite soon, so I'll be fine. We'll just leave them how they are now. Uh, that's actually a good offer. Thank you. How about we ally to some of our normal allies? Due to Poland? Let's see. No, they hate us. Oh, yes. We hate Poland. Belarus, they end up in a war practically everywhere. Just have to wait for them to go nuts. And, uh, Serbia will just give us practically a free ticket to attack anyone we want, so... To find Serbia will be good. Albania, Kosovo, Romania, Hungary, Croatia, Slovenia, Austria, Slovakia, 
one of the Faustia likes us. No, 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 they hate us. They very much hate us, Greece. So then where is Serbia? It should be in this area. Serbia. How did I not notice them? To send them both that. Yay. And I think Turkey actually has some half decent units, so I'm going to diplomatic offer Turkey. Even though they pretty much hate us. If not, I might have to offer this. Or send a diplomatic offer to the states. Because I want their leopard tank design. Guess I can't get it. Well, the states. They absolutely hate us right now, too. Could use some of their nice tanks, so. I don't really does it cost a whole lot there. Trimian military vessels, sure. I'm willing to pay for that. Uh huh. It's cost us a boat or a butt load of money. So we're just gonna accept by Lebanon. Venezuela. We're gonna have to Diplomatic counter offer? You know what? Fine. I'm just gonna accept it because I want it. Oh, thank you, China. That was very thoughtful. No longer. Okay. I don't know if I want to select. No longer you see the topic. I'm going to just because it gets annoying. Yeah, it's on a positive trend. Oh, Canada. I'll buy stuff from them for cheaper. <laughs> Probably not. Finland's going to be a pain in the ass. I can tell right off the bat that they are going to be. What do we have for... No, only 33% more justification. Why don't you take a look at Poland. I have a 60% more justification. I do want to be able to take on the Ukraine, but I don't quite have that or justification for it yet. So I gotta wait until shit hits a fan before I can do that. Till then, we can take a look at our military and what we're building. I think I may as well at least be the one to dictate what we're building. It is, after all, a dictatorship. Just kidding. I love the uh, BMPs. I want to make some more of those. And the Vodniks. They're fairly decent units. So you might make uh, five of them. Make five of these. It's actually kind of lagging. Except. Alright, what else? Tanks are definitely important, as is artillery. We do want these patents. I'll put that up to 30. You don't have the best tanks, exactly. I don't know if I want to make it a... Oops. Venezuela is under attack. We should declare war on Brazil. We're gonna have to hold off on that, buddy. We aren't getting to Brazil. <laughs> Brazil's a bit too far. Alright. That's yeah, I should definitely get some artillery set up. And with this uh two hundred three millimeter pion. So I might do these because it's uh, only 18 days to make. Uh, domestic approval report. 
on a positive trend. How well is that? Of course it is. Need some supply trucks. So we're going to need a few of those made. Now I definitely want to make sure that we're making some aircraft. So we're going to make some multi-role fighters. And it doesn't look like we have very many decent aircraft. So I'm going to diplomatic offer actually the states. Uh, that's terrible. Screw you. How much do you hate us? Unit to missile designs. I can get an F-18. F-18s. F-35s. They're the fancy ones. I don't know what the difference is between the VTOL and the Lightning 2. And the Lightning 2 JSF. Future BVR anti-defense missile. Anti-air defense missile, or air defense missile, I mean. So medium reaction time. Medium reaction time. Medium reaction time, 18 health. 18 health. Okay, pop up. 1066, 75. 1066-60 So I think these uh, Lightning 2 JSFs are the best choice So I need future stealth fighters technology before I can do that uh, Can't exactly do that quite so soon so She might buy up some of their research just to Advanced chemistry. That would be good for my population. No, I'm sorry, Sri Lanka. Except. Eh, sorry. Go back to this. The. And technology. Medical. Uh, may as well get something while we're at it. I mean. to pay for that and definitely it's going to be a ridiculous cost get rid of our uh, guess the biofuels facility no that's not very expensive so uh, improved fire control is really the big thing that's expensive alright Oh, really? Nice. You know, America still hates us. can we buy Maybe I should try buying from China it'll be a heck of a lot cheaper maybe China has these technologies that I don't there's actually in real life China's D 
decently advanced, so... Well, they do have some stuff. I do want to get some more advanced stuff, so... Thank you, China. Let's see what uh, North Korea's got. You know, I really want to help you out, North Korea, but I just don't see it happening very well. I guess I could do bombing runs of South Korea, but uh, I don't see that happening yet. I got to deal with U Ukraine. Well, it's still silent over there. Should build some more military good facilities. Industrial goods military. I'm gonna start by deploying our entire military that we can. Except Come on, just deploy, just deploy, just deploy, just deploy, just deploy. Come on. We have ridiculous number of units. Yay. Just a ridiculous number of units. Was this a thousand units right here? Alright, 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 alright. Let's put it on the border of said country. Actually, you know what? You guys can stay here because I'm probably going to need you here. Just entrench. You might have to deal with the wrath of Poland. Speaking of that, I'm just gonna actually have you entrench right about here. How are you doing, Belarus? I will offer you. Guess I could offer you that. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Everyone's just like, oh shit. Where are you guys going? You're not fighting anyone right now. I want you to entrench in here. You all entrench right up here. Oh, it gets laggy, 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 laggy. If you guys are noticing any lag here, yeah, it's getting laggy. This game doesn't really run very well in the Vita product, so I'm not quite sure why. I'm just going to start by saving quickly. Uh, from Russia with love. I'm Sean Connery. Alright. Soon I want to take on the Ukraine, but I don't see that happening a whole lot. I'm going to cancel our shit with them. Doesn't want us. We need a reason to hit the Ukraine. Come on. Like, we still like it when you have an embassy here. I guess this will be a good idea to, because I can keep building up my military and my economy. I don't exactly want to get kicked out of the UN first go. I could take out Poland, I guess. Uh, let's see what we got against Poland. We hate Poland. 
tensions. Their economy is average, I guess. What could we do to piss off Poland? We gotta try and piss off Poland somehow. Espionage. I don't want to do it to their capital, I want to do it about here. Because I'm going to be taking over the capital too soon. Unless I want to sabotage this facility. They have an air f defense facility. Guess I could. You're going to be sabotaging everything. Dun 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 One of our intelligence agents assigned to Poland is believed to have been captured. Captured? Captured? Oh no. We're gonna have to take them over, it seems. Uh, yet again, so sad. Oh, they escaped. How did they do that? Let's see how Poland thinks of Poland thinks of us now. But I mean, satellite coverage. We'll add a satellite to order. May as well. Won't be a bad idea. We could use a. Uh, Quick communications and even a reconnaissance satellite it cost us a bit, but we can do that. We can do that. We can do that. Dun, 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 dun. Let me make sure you have all this stuff selected so we can start researching on this. High bandwidth infrastructure, that's very, very important. How is this people supposed to watch YouTube and Netflix at work? Legalized controlled substances, yep. I do want that. Protection of free will, urban renewal, propaganda machine. <sighs> oh, sorry guys, my mouse just kind of stopped working. I have a replacement unit coming from Funk soon. I just had to send this fellow back and he said that they'd ha be happy to replace my mouse. It's just the uh, revision one, so the revision one had some issues with it that uh, were very, very unfortunate. Uh, I'm gonna give authority to all these. up the nuclear missiles. I don't exactly want to be in shit with the UN so soon. You're all gonna have launch authority. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Happy? I want my troops loaded up with them soon. Auto deploy, auto deploy, auto deploy, auto deploy, auto deploy. I don't know if I wanna select that. Most of our battles will be in Europe, but uh, no, we're not going to select that. Some scuds. You know, it's like you have to make sure you have good missiles. have more for good reason to hit them yet. Wanna check right after that. 
Let's gotta select these last few guys here. All right, now that they're all selected and we're good with that. Uh, back here. 50 56% more justification. They have 100%. Yet they won't fucking hit us. Or one of our, our allies. So... Serbia, they usually start causing shit, so hopefully they hurry up. Maybe they can fight Romania. Let's see what's going on over here. North Korea has a massive military, they just aren't very good at using it. They take all of these troops and entrench them right about there. They could do okay. Don't think they could do the best, but what usually happens is these guys up here, they end up absolutely fine. They just stay right up there. There's a lot of troops there, you know. So once South Korea takes them over, they go straight to the capital. They'll pound right through this somehow. I have no idea how. Once they do that, then to get to capital, they could take the capital, and then all that land and all those troops over there automatically become theirs. Then those troops are used to cannon fodder against China and Russia. So that becomes an issue fairly quickly. I note, but uh, kind of getting tired of waiting. Belarus usually starts causing shit soon too. Fortunately, they haven't been all too wild. Let's see what Belarus's DEFCON is five. Hmm. Czech Republic and Poland. Yeah. New alliance born between Georgia Republic and Poland. So they're not really allies to a whole lot of people, are they? Oh yeah, they are. Shit. <laughs> All my enemies. How wonderful. I have to take Poland soon. I just hope I can. Star some units coming this way. You know what? What the hell? I'm going to send my units there anyways. I'm going to. That's their capital. Yeah, it is. So I'm going to entrench my units right in here. Right in whatever this country is, Belarus. Hopefully Serbia causes some shit, or maybe Belarus, because I have the troops to back them. You know? Because that's a fuck ton of troops right there. To get all my air force into one area. In order to do that, I'm gonna have to actually zoom out. Aircraft. I need an airfield that's one of our friends can land right about here. Once all these uh, aircraft end up getting down there, we should be good. It's going to be a lot of overflow that is sometimes going in there. Now I'll be near close airfields anyway, so we're good. We're good, we're good.
All right, we're gonna begin very, very shortly, because we still have a fuck ton of units on our way. This artillery is gonna rip their ass a new one. It's gonna quickly save it while we're at it. We can take a look at our resources in the meantime, just to make sure we're not too much in craziness. Well, we definitely need some more. Uh, do 108% of demand. Increase the domestic price on that. There we go. <laughs> that just does it. We're okay for military goods. Petroleum, we're okay. Mind you, we're moving a lot of units, that's why we're using so much. A lot of units are entrenching like a lot. That is absolutely insane. There's not going to be a, com or a country that will be able to give us a run for our money this easily. They all could, all together, but actually, maybe America. Yeah. America's pretty pissed off at us. We both have a uh, good war justification for each other. Poland's probably like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. It's just like, yeah. We're coming, buddy. Don't worry. I want you to balance the books, I guess. Uh... Balance the budget, yeah. Maybe, I don't know. We don't throw our social spending too high. Hmm, I have to reject that. Sorry, bud. What do you need to fight any- Who do you need to fight anyways, Nicaragua? That didn't do any good. That actually threw us more into debt. Alright. I'm gonna have you... I don't want any bonds. You went to balance the budget. I'm gonna put some locks on you. Our last few units are there. Belarus is bulking up somewhere for some reason. Declare war. Aircraft. Just do a nice little bombing run in that area. Actually, we're gonna take our units and we're just gonna have to change the setting. So I want these to be none because I want to be able to control them. I'm going on low. If we want, I guess we could watch. All of our frickin' Air Force go nuts. What happened? I thought we just declared war on them. I was like, what? Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. <laughs> it's like frickin' machine gun rocket fire. That's all this world, we're gonna have to... I haven't seen that before. Okay, we're gonna go aircraft nuts on these guys. It's like, yeah. Fuck yeah, Russia. The capital's gonna be gone in just seconds. Yeah! Russia! Russia! Russia!
It's like, well, we can. Alright, you're gonna move up here, you're going to. Hey, move to. Alright, now you guys are gonna move up, you're gonna entrench. Because holy fuck is that ever lagging. All of my aircraft, though, I want you guys out of here. Get your asses out of here. Get your asses out of here. I don't want that to town to be ours. <laughs> One is the loneliest number. It's like, yes, we own this place. I'm sorry. It's like, now you're coming too. Funly. There's really no point, Belarus. I'm sorry to say that. You're kind of going to go down. Sick, yes, yeah, shit. We see all, we see how many Russians are war. We're going. We're gone. Fuck this. You guys are on your own. President, take your gun. You're the one fighting now. Holy shit. I can't even see anything, that's how nuts it is. It's going to entrench in their capital. And we did it. Now, hopefully it doesn't do that stupid capital bouncing. It shouldn't. This hasn't changed the capital city yet, technically. Kinda sorta did, but... It'll declare this is our city soon. I'm just gonna save. I really don't know why it takes so long. There's no point in you doing that. Let's see. And stay there. There's no point in you getting destroyed by garrisons, like, really. Treasury benefits and capital. The capital actually chains. What the hell? Fixed capitals is on. That pisses me off. Now I have to deal with balancing capitals. Yeah, we kinda got ya. Whereas I just wanna take over their capital and have their country. Like normal. You know, much like in real life. Just kidding.
Whatever this aircraft is doing here, I don't like it. You guys are going. Fine. You can help. Yet again. Nice. No longer receive this topic. Is that the max of things? Yeah, we're kind of short on military goods. And I'm not going to try to compensate for 14 million worth of military goods. That's just ridiculous. Nice, we discovered high speed trains. I know we're being bombarded. You see, we should have already had it. There shouldn't be this stupid bouncing capital thing going on. Like this. Alright, I guess we'll have to go over there. Trench right along in there. Because what pisses me off the most is that it's just gonna keep bouncing and bouncing and bouncing and bouncing. This actually dictates the land to us. And again. See, now we have to go through there to, to get to the capital. Which is where again? It's just over there. <laughs> so you are going to have to move together. We're literally eating coal at this point. Just look at that, all the big black clouds. It's literally all you see over the city. Much respect, I should have just taken over Finland. do an air force run we have to take 37 in there but just enough for some cover
Alright, so now we're gonna go up to here. And we're just going to entrench right outside the capital. Guess you can send someone down there. Come on. Fine. Of course we are under attack. We are always under attack. We are under attack with Georgia Republic. Oh shit, scary. How is our city not falling yet? We gain more money from taking the capital, but the capital pops around, as we can see there. Fine. There we fucking go. Only had to do it three or four times. But the... Holy shit, the Ukraine's actually getting kind of close. I need to put a stop to that, like, now. I'm going to get kind of close to the Ukraine. And my entire air force is going to get kind of close to them. And their troops, come on. You just have an unlimited air force, just send them all in. It's like bye bye Ukraine. doing some crazy shit to them. I don't know why we didn't just go through here. Ah, oh, I guess this is the best route in some way. Some sick and twisted way. Yeah, you are all going to do an air patrol. It's because we don't want to lose a bunch of shit. Our navy is doing a decent job. George Republic's being a jerkwad. They cut everything down, unfortunately. Not gonna be able to run through every single damn garrison I have. Maybe I should have done George Republic first to so they're out of my hair? I don't know. Poland was probably a good bet because they actually have a decent military to combat me with. So does the Ukraine. Uh, let's just say entrenched in there. Or you're just infantry garrisons. You have nowhere else to go. Hmm. 
Alright. Diplomatic offer. Well, no, why wouldn't I accept? <sighs> Guess maybe I should just bomb Georgia Republic. Just to knock them all down. <laughs> all right. How wonderful. All right. Put this on full. I think I might send you guys over here. That way you can air patrol. Just make sure things are good. Good, 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 good. How is he not dead yet? Don't worry, George Republic will have your capital soon enough. I just have to deal with this little issue. And all the issue is, is I want you guys here. You almost didn't survive now, did you? Oh, how sad. <laughs> And we are enjoying their capital and their land. Now I think it's time to squash Georgia Republic. I'm not quite a Republican. <laughs> a very bad joke. UN provides military advisors. How wonderful. You gotta love the UN for what good they're doing stopping me from attacking all these countries lower taxes a paramount may as well be nice so I gotta keep them up a tad amount yeah. just to compensate for the bad trade today your focus is on maximizing profit opportunities and product self-sufficiency.
If you think this is bad, George Republic, you just wait. I'm gonna have you taken over very, sir, very, very shortly. Might ally myself with Cubo if I can. Cubo loves us. Formal alliance, missile defense, mutual defense. How wonderful. I absolutely love Cuba. <laughs> Fidel, such a great guy. But I think in the event that uh, the Americans want to invade Cuba again. Remember this, this is June 1st, 2020. I may just surround the Cuban island with a fuck ton of naval vessels and put some aircraft on their island. Make it harder and harder for them to break through. Enemy falls. Ukraine fell? Oh, how so sad. So sad, hell. I'm so sorry I wasn't able to help you guys. Can I declare war on you? No, I can't. Fuck. Sorry. If I knew earlier. Uh, except. A George Republic? They're being very, very dangerous. Then capital jumped down, did it? Oh, it did. Alright, we own it. That's well and good. Now I'm gonna have to distribute some of these guys just over here. And you guys, like, oh, actually, I'm gonna send you all over. Just uh, right about here, I think. The capital. There's some units on this area, so I'm gonna send them down here. It's going to entrench them along our friend's border. I wish I could. Sorry. Diplomatic offer. Can I make Japan any offers? No, I don't think I can. Alright, uh, yeah, Cuba. I forgot. United States will end up at war with Cuba. Declare war on Taiwan. China can handle that. I really don't have the justification quite yet. Holy shit! They're really going missile nuts. Some freaking badasses. A run with my air force will soften them up, but that still needs to take its, you know, time. My Air Force. Uh, sure, repair. Let's like that. My Navy. Which happened to own a fair amount. Just good because only a fair amount of navy is helpful. Uh, naval vessels. I'm going to send them all over here to my pals. It's going to select this and set it to none so they do exactly what I want them to do.
is if I can defend Cuba, they can be used as a missile. Well, look at that, the states is already at war with Mexico so soon. Of course, America is going to win, there's no doubt about it. Just like, yeah, we'll launch a bunch of missiles. All will be swell. Satellite available for launch. Agree. Come on, our buddies Mexico are gonna fall. Dun 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 that is wonderful. Well, do we see? How about we see what we're doing for this? How about we see what we're doing? Uh, fabrication. Ah, we can make some more. Should over. Should have ordered a whole lot more. Make 35, I thought I ordered an F-35A. We're gonna make a fuck ton of F-35As. Part of my language, of course. I wanna put like a hundred or so on the table. Cause you won't be able to effectively counter America without a ton of them, so. Duh. I'll put 150. I guess you could do 200. Two ten. Yeah, let's go two ten. Uh naval. We need some more destroyers. Mm, destroyers take forever to make. But, uh, Put 50 on layaway. Not layaway, I guess, but something, you know. Artillery locating radar. Okay. Not a whole lot of my guys are down in the Cuban area yet. I'll have even more justification against America after. They wipe out our friends, Mexico. See? We feel outrage towards Russia. We feel outrage towards the United States. America's just like, kind of, yeah, I'll send a few guys down there. Nothing too crazy quite yet. Uh, do I have any other enemies? Be soon to be South Korea. I'm almost tempted just to go and help North Korea. But we really don't have any war justification against them. I also want to go help China soon, too. Since they have to deal with Taiwan, but... We only have a 56% war justification against Taiwan. So. China happens as a lot of units. They're also currently dealing with South Korea, which is a direct threat to their border. So. South Korea will become more of a threat to me as well. So, I'm gonna send some more units down there. It's because I kind of don't feel comfortable with only a thousand units. Kidding. It's about 390 units, but. We'll increase our unit amounts.
Finland really, really hates us. I don't know how long it will be until Saviri Skinarakas declares war on us. I like Finland. It's a very nice area, so I hope to be able to one day take it over. <laughs> Actually, I think I should try and increase my troop presence near the Finnish border. Let's set our guys right up there. Trench them here. Trench them here. So you won't trench you here. Seems like next to none of our subs have came down. Actually, none of them have. I don't know what's gotten into them. They're usually such good subs. And, uh, no, no slick sub. Or not subs, I mean, uh. Oh, my mouse stopped working. It's going to be a pain in the ass. That's why I'm not playing first person shooters as of late. Alright, now it's working again. We'll just go in here. We'll select this. I want you guys all right here. It's currently on a positive trend. Oh, wow. It's because we can keep dropping taxes. And increasing social spending. I want corporations to be taxed proportionally more than the rest of the country. Just by a little bit, at least. Because this game kind of has a weird economy. Where everything must be taxed equally for it to work. Holy shit. It's like, yeah, we have everybody here. Yeah, I'll send a good chunk of these guys. Good chunk of you is actually going to have to go down here to South Korea. To find North Korean borders. So I'll have around 600, 700 units down there and we'll... I'm thinking I should take some down here just to defend the area. Cause that's just how we're going to handle it, I guess. 159 units should be overkill. Hmm. They have a fair amount down there already. Trenching. I also don't want to bite off more than I can chew. So we're for around 100. So I mean we'll have over 200 to, th or we'll have about 200 to 300 units. So Iran, does Iran like us? Yes, it does. Let's see what we can do for Iran. Syria. I guess they kind of like us too. No, I think I want to take over Syria eventually. No, I definitely want to take over Iraq, but uh, Syria can be a very useful ally in this area. But Egypt, I don't want to end up in a fight with them too soon. Yeah. But uh, Iran, I guess, could be useful. We could help. Just gotta readjust my desk here. You have a satellite launched. Wonderful. Could help them out with their Turkey situation. Or Turkish situation. Can't declare war on either Azerbaijan or Armenia. Can't like tell Azerbaijan assisted George Republic when I was playing as Turkey. 
That's kind of a good thing. When they have already out Russia. <sighs> so if you hear, if you hear anything loud in the background, it'll probably be my PC. I guess I could do some noise cancellation on it, but I don't know if I feel like doing that. I've done it before and it kind of uh, screws with your voice, so... Makes things a little bit more muffled. I can apply it just a little bit if I really wanted to. But uh, at that point I don't know if it would really matter a whole lot. Could help, so... Germany is just nuts. They're just like, I hate you guys. This is their capital, right? Yeah, it's not too far, but it's probably going to do that whole capital bouncing thing, which will piss me right off. Hey, look, I have a route right into Germany. I may as well take it and knock out the one of the biggest superpowers I can. Well, I can, so... I guess that's a uh, idea. We'll go do that. You have 1800 units here. We're just gonna pile them all along the German border. Entrench everybody. It's everyone going entrench there. <laughs> it's like, we really want that power plant. Even though it's a coal power plant. Consumer goods, we need to make some more on. So I guess I could start making some. Build industrial goods, consumer. Just make a few of those. Our military goods, I kind of couldn't handle it. We needed about 16 or so. And that's just about what I, what all I can do for now. Petroleum are good in. Build. I don't want to build too much just because it can throw our economy right into the drain. You should be compensating for that, buddy. Bring this down a tad bit. Alright, now we're in the pause. Or plus, yes. Not making. We're not losing a whole lot of money today. Which tends to happen. So I'm gonna leave you guys up here, just in case something happens. You guys are gonna stay entrenched here. It's only 10 of you, so... It's going to garrison these guys up along here. You guys can all stay there. It'll be okay. I'll do good. Just send you over there. <sighs> Germany is probably getting scared shitless. Actually, Germany has one of the larger militaries, so they could give us a run for our money. And I don't exactly want to risk that. France could too, and so could the UK, so... I want them to just leave my friends alone. Huh. I want those guys out of there, though. You guys cannot stay there. That is not a safe area for you. 
you'll get fucked by Tur the Turkish Navy the second something goes wrong. Okay, so good, we have some of our navy there, alright, that's not ours. Alright, you guys, I'm gonna send you here. Some of you guys have gotta get spread out, too. You're gonna patrol up here. You're gonna patrol along here. I'm gonna have you patrol along here, too. We just gotta get a lot of patrols going. So you're gonna start your patrols here to here. Oops. I also want you patrolling. Patrol there. To send you guys up here. Send some frigates to patrol over there. Give them some decent time distance. Send another frigate. And we'll send a few over here. Send these patrol bolts over. Uh, these subs, I want you guys patrolling here. Just that sub, actually. And I want you guys over here so we can secure that part of the island. You guys are gonna go over there too? Am I right? I think I'm gonna have you guys over here just so you can patrol this area. Patrol, you're gonna patrol that. Patrol up here. Sorry if I'm breathing into the mic. Yeah. I guess the uh, time distance, so it's about half. Alright. Send you guys over there to patrol. And then I'm thinking I'm going to have you patrol over here. Then this other sub will just patrol over here. <laughs> Alright, you guys are we up here. Can we publicate so sort of about Haiti? Kind of okayish. So a patrol here. Send you guys to patrol here, I guess. Patrol. Uh, yeah, have you patrol along here too.
have your patrol up here. You are going to patrol along here. Alright guys, I'm back. Just going to continue setting up our patrol units here. Guess we can unload whatever we got around here. Patrol. I'm gonna have you unload your units in there. Have you patrol along there? Hmm, reject. Sorry, buddy. Have you patrol up along here? Same with you. You're gonna patrol. It's very important. If anyone has cargo that they need to unload. Guess you can send a couple subs up here. Sunny anti sub patrol bolt. This guy will have to patrol in here. You're going to start over here, all of you. I'm going to patrol up along here. You're going to patrol here. You're going to patrol. So are you. You're going to declare war on the states. Alright, once you get up here, I'm going to have you patrol. Patrol. 
ничего. Ничего. All right, pause it a turn. We're just gonna save this quickly. I'm going to send all of my aircraft, like every last little bit, out of there, and you're gonna land into stupid ship broke. Can't stand it when this mouse does that. Come on! Can you please go? I got pizza. I know, go! Fuck. Just going to save this quickly. Alright guys, I am back. We are now at war with America who attacked our good friends Cuba. And right now I'm just making sure that uh, Cuba is well defended, at least navally. This will separate them. Take these subs over here. <coughs> the Americans are somehow hitting us. Jesus, that's the UK. These guys, you'll just go right over here. Is there anywhere for you land there? Yes, there is. Wonderful. <coughs> I don't have a whole lot in the way of aerial power there yet. <coughs> These uh, artillery guys here, I do want to hit them. So I guess I could have that a try. We'll see how it goes. This is just a shitty little unit, but... Well, he can do okay if it wasn't for those jets. Yeah. Those jets are gonna cause an issue. <coughs> I just kinda wanna patrol the borders, so... <coughs> Are you guys up? <coughs> Alright, we're gonna give launch authority to a fuck ton of missiles now. Dun 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 dun. Navy, I'm gonna put that on medium. Our subs are getting hit like sh 
Holy shit, they're getting hit like crazy. Wow. I don't know if we're reasonably going to be able to defend ourselves in that. <coughs> uh, air launch. Naval launch. We'll auto deploy all of these guys. Including this guy. <coughs> I want to aircraft every single one of them and fly the fuck over there. Units. I think I might <coughs> consider buffering up my defenses to this area, but I don't know. Because they are fucking tossing a hell of a lot of missiles this way. Fair amount of AGMs. Can I do missile defense satellites yet? Research required. What do we need to research for them? Oh yeah, you guys go, 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 you're taking this American ship on. Attack unit. Come on. That may be an adva advanced, advanced, advanced American vessel, but you can do it, buddy. Uh, no, maybe you can't, but, uh, maybe you can. Uh, yeah, you're gonna die. This isn't going well. China isn't. Dun, 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 dun. You know what? I think it would be best if I just quell that little shithole. Kind of like South Korea in real life. I just mean the. Uh, <sighs> mean that they're taking us all on and they're gonna be a threat to both China and us too so that's going to be an issue I don't want to take all my troops out of the whatever that's my issue <coughs> so I guess I could take on Finland but uh, I don't know if I'm going to right away I guess I'll leave the troops I have there I mean at Finland at Finland So I guess all my troops are right in here. My aircraft, you guys can just go along here. I'm gonna need you guys to solve a problem for me. See, South Korean problem. <laughs> I don't know how many troops that is. Actually, you see, that really isn't a whole lot of troops. Alright, my mouse is not working. Again, it'll just take a second and it'll start back up. And the drivers will reconnect and all that stuff. There we go, we have mouse movement again. 
Where are my 2,000 units? Alright guys, so I saved the game again just because it froze right when I highlighted the units, so I'm going to be very careful. Ah, it froze again when I highlighted it. That's just because there's so much units. I only want to select between this units or these uh, tanks. I want them all right along in here. It's lagging so bad. It's like, can I be a lag master? Yes, you can. Like I said, this game runs practically great on Nevada and graphics, but it runs like shit on my. Not Nevada, I mean, it runs great on Intel and AMD graphics, but it runs like shit on any other graphics solutions I have. That's my issue. At least. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna declare war on them soon. I kinda wanna send my entire air force down there. Uh, yeah. <coughs> Alright, we're gonna go over here. Select air. I'm going to deploy them all. I'm going to select them all as well. <coughs> and you guys, that's going to defend the North Korean capital. I have no interest in taking the US over so soon, so my interest will just be in dealing with so the, the threat of South Korea, I mean, so mm -hmm. you're going to have to do that quickly and swiftly and fairly fast. Alright, so I'm going to send you guys, okay, that lagged a lot. Holy shit, I'm probably going to have to restart the game. <coughs> You know what guys, I'm going to go ahead and save and restart the game. <laughs> 